Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Maya, if you're new here. I'm a 24 year old living in the Metro Atlanta area and I make a little bit of this, a little bit of that, but mostly faith and lifestyle. Today's Friday, y'all, so happy Friday. Oh, I thought I saw. <laughs> I thought I saw a police officer and I ain't gonna lie y'all I'm sure doing a dash because I'm on the way to my eyebrow appointment right now y'all know I mentioned it in my last vlogs over episode that I was supposed to get them done yesterday that didn't happen so we rescheduled for today I'm supposed to get there literally like when my appointment is so I'm just trying to hurry up you know it's been a busy Friday morning for me filled with meetings and things so literally I'm going to get my eyebrows done and then I have another meeting I have to hop on at 11 um so i decided to bring my work bag with me can you guys see it yeah brought my little work bag with me so that i can just work at a coffee shop for most of the day so i'm gonna do that and then also today is the first friday of the month so our young adult ministry at church um does our experiences on the first friday so i'll be going to that tonight i'm so excited to be getting these eyebrows done y'all getting our brows threaded is just such an underweighted underweighted <laughs> like i feel like it's an underrated maintenance it's such a small quick easy thing but it really makes a difference like i was looking at myself the other day and i was like girl i don't feel cute and then i was like you know what i need my eyebrows done that's what it is brows are done guys they look really good she eats them up every time they're a little dark right now but i feel like you know i'll wash my face and it'll be cool my eyebrows have actually been growing since i started getting them threaded because my right eyebrow used to really give me problems like my right eyebrow is the ugly it's the ugly eyebrow and it just used to be hold on i gotta hit it i gotta bust a yui hold on anyways yeah my right eyebrow like is really my struggle brow it was like very short and stumpy but since i've been getting them threaded they have been it's been growing out more and the um my brow stylist i don't know what do you call that by brow tech whatever you call it she even said that today she was like your brows have been growing and i'm like okay it's not just me that noticed that so getting your brows threaded does hurt in case you were wondering it is a little pain but it's not anything crazy at all like it's so manageable so tolerable the bottom part hurts more like this part underneath it hurts more than the top but today i was in there telling myself it doesn't hurt it doesn't hurt you're good it doesn't hurt I'm back home y'all and i'm about to put on bachelor in paradise because it came on last night but i didn't watch it i did watch the golden bachelor which so yes i'm watching the golden bachelor and it's cute but it also is very much cringy you know but it is sweet because these are older people so these are people who like some of them are widowed, some of them are divorced, some of them never been married, I think. So for a lot of them, they were kind of sharing how like they felt at their age, they would maybe never find love again, you know? So like in that sense, it's sweet. I'm definitely gonna have to redo my hair before young adults tonight, but um, yeah. But it's also cringy because like they be kissing and stuff and it just be kind of corny sometimes, but whatever, I'm gonna watch it. I love Bachelor in Paradise. like out of bachelor the bachelor at bachelor in paradise is my favorite out of all three of them say a season of the bachelor or the bachelor is bad i may continue to watch it just because i want to watch bachelor in paradise and see what's going on there and kind of get context for who these people are you know oh i don't think i told you guys so this top is from skims but skims actually reached out to me and sent me this top and another one which was such a blessing it's really crazy how it all happened my boyfriend and i was at church it was on a friday night we were at church and i was looking down at my phone to take some notes and i saw something from skims i said y'all know how the old folk be when they trying to look at something they, they put their phone far they be like that's literally how it was this is the cotton jersey t-shirt and i have actually never bought I've bought tank tops from Skins before, but I've never tried any of their regular shirts. So I love the color. This is in mineral. I love the fit of this top. I'm realizing that I don't like super cropped tops anymore. Like that's just really not my vibe. Um, so this is a really good length and everything. Watch my TikTok video for like, you know, the whole little review. I just wanted to tell y'all that. I just left Target. Obviously we finna head to the church. I got on my little baptism shirt, y'all. This is the shirt my church be giving when you get baptized. But 
it's raining if you can't tell and I needed a new umbrella so got that came in handy and then I wanted a new SD card because if you know you know these little SD cards be filling up real quick and I needed some new moisturizers I got the Target brand I normally get Aveeno but unfortunately they change things up so Avino has two types of moisturizer one with SPF 15 and one with SPF 30 I only get the SPF 15 because when I I bought the SPF 30 one time y'all I was looking like Casper so never again and in general I just don't rock with moisturizers they got SPF 13 I mean SPF 30 because I'm kind of scarred from that so I got the Target brand with SPF 15 but I'm gonna try to see if I can find another brand with SPF 15 in it like a good brand I'm so I'm just like Avino why would you do that like I got some chapstick because I needed it and then I also got some gum because I always keep that thing on me. It's 552. Um our event actually starts at 6 30, but I'm literally only like seven minutes away from the church. So I'm gonna go ahead and head up there. Tonight I'll be focusing on getting content. Ooh, y'all know when y'all get like that sharp pain in your chest. Oh my gosh. Like where it be feeling tight. Oh my gosh. Oh, Ooh. okay. Hey y'all, it is Saturday now, Saturday afternoon. As you guys can see, I'm like dressed or whatever. And it's because we actually had a homegoing service at our church today. And whenever we have homegoing services, um, staff is kind of like, you know, all hands on deck. So I just got home from that literally like 20 minutes ago. But I'm about to change because Mookie and I are hanging out today. We're going to Pont City Market. If you know, you know, I love Pont City Market. So I'm really excited. Mookie has never been to Ponce. And if you're new here, you're like, girl, who the world is Mookie? Okay, who is Pookie? <laughs> Mookie is my cousin, but y'all can't call him Mookie. Y'all gotta call him the king, okay? He now lives in like the metro area. So, you know, you just kind of want to like explore more and see different things in the city. So I picked up my camera and started vlogging because I was like, I don't know what I want to wear. And y'all, it's chilly today like actually chilly like actually cold it's like 58 or something like that maybe low low 60s so i'm like mm, i don't know what to wear i feel like i call myself like buying fall items and here we are in this fall and now i'm like i don't know what to wear i have this um denim shirt that i got from zara right so like maybe low key i could do a denim on denim look hold on i actually don't think it's giving denim on denim because these denims are not on camera they look kind of close but in person they're really not that close so i think i'm gonna do these jeans with this sweater that i got from zara and honestly i don't feel like redoing my hair so it's giving it's giving the hat y'all gonna be sick of me in this hat honestly i may go to the garage and go get some more today because i love these hats well i love this hat um so yeah i think that's what we're gonna go with i feel like that's cute and then like a cream bag and my cream new balance So I'm gonna go back that way because yes, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Let's see. Oh no. <gasps> what do I do? It's literally locked. I think I have to find somewhere else to park, which is kind of like, bruh. Hold on. Because it took me, it took me like 20 minutes just to find, just to park right here because. When I tell y'all, everybody and their mama is at Ponce today. When I found this spot, I'm over here like, okay, cool. You know, ain't nobody up here. It's the reason ain't nobody up here. Because this is where you park for, like, the offices and residents. But it's like, dude, where else can I park? I could potentially try to park at the Kroger across the street, which I'm feeling like that's what I should have did this whole time. But it's just like, I don't want to have to walk across by myself because the Ponce is, it's across the street. Public access this way? I could've went right here the whole time. <laughs> Let's try this again because this sign down here say public access this way. Through here. Okay, cool. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh my gosh, I can take some pictures. 
can fix it. Oh, I can test the pictures right here, y'all. Are you kidding me? I'm finna go back to the car because I brought my, um, what you call that, tripod? I'm finna take the pictures right here. It'll be very embarrassing if somebody comes up here and see me, but at the same time, I don't care. Because we got to do what we got to do. It's the back and forth for me. I left up too early. I don't like these, whatever. I don't like these guys. So y'all saw where I was at, right? I was in there and I had finished taking my pictures at that point because they just wasn't it just wasn't giving. Okay, I'm finna look at them real quick and see, but it wasn't giving. And then this like group of older black people. Hold on, cause I know my keys, annoying. There was this group of older black people and they walked in and they were just staring at me. And I was so annoyed. Cause I'm like, what are you, why are you staring at me? What are you staring at? Like, hello, yes, I was in here taking pictures of myself. And what about it? But yeah, no, these pictures are not eating y'all. It's not giving. saw we got h and f burger just kind of walked around a little bit mookie really liked ponds he said he would definitely come back so i kind of want some cookies y'all like i'm kind of craving i'm really craving tiff treats real ones no tiff treats okay but insomnia is also good insomnia is right underneath tiff treats so i'm like i can settle for that but i don't want to go to an insomnia in the city because they're not gonna have no parking that's the Pink. That I was going to get cookies. However, we're gonna make a pit stop. We're making a pit stop. I don't know if you guys can tell, but I'm at the mall. <laughs> we're going to H and M. I'm gonna see what I can find. I'm not looking for nothing super specific. I kind of just want some cute fall stuff. So let's see. I'm back home. So let's do a mini mini haul so i went to h&m obviously and garage and i got a few things i got another hat this hat is actually from garage y'all i freaking love these hats i think they're so stylish and they really add to your outfit so i got it in this blue color um don't be surprised if i get more i got this basic green top i actually have this same top from garage in another color i just feel like a part of you know having a great wardrobe is having basics i love this color perfect for the fall winter love the material can't go wrong i got these pants what are these called the porter trouser pants they're a black pant yeah just like pants that you can dress up or dress down and i love having that you know versatility yeah this is what they look like i know you can't get the full vibe so y'all gonna have to wait until i try them on in a video but right now we ain't doing it now let's do h&m i got this really cute sweater this little sweater what color is this i don't know it's like a neutral color but i just thought this was a great basic as well 
and I feel like I'd be able to pair it with a lot. I got a similar sweater in this dark green color. Yeah, I can't really hold it up right. <laughs> but yeah, it's literally just a sweater. I got this white button down top because you can literally style these a million ways. And I am really bad about staining my button down tops. Like y'all remember in the last vlog sober, I had on that pink and white button down. I got a stain on it and I'm praying that when I wash it, it comes out. But I was like, just in case it don't, let me re-up and get another one. <laughs> they had a lot of different colors. They had pink and blue. So I'll probably go back and get more. But you know, just to start off, I was like, let me get a white one. Another pair of pants. These are, what are these called? These don't have a name. But I mean, they're just like some slacks trousers in this dark burgundy color. I like the the way they look, like the fit and the style of them. I get a lot of my business casual attire from H&M. If you're looking for any, highly recommend. They're great for it. Lastly, I got this, um, what's this called? <sighs> Whatever it's called type material. I got this. I keep hitting this hat, oh my gosh. It's a shirt, it's not a jacket, it's a shirt. But um, I got it because I thought it was like different. You know, I didn't have anything like in my wardrobe. I didn't have anything like this in my wardrobe. And I just feel like I kind of need to branch out a little bit when it comes to my closet. Like I like to buy a lot of the like the same thing or similar pieces over and over again. And that's why I've realized I keep recreating similar looks because I pretty much had the same pieces. So honestly, I don't know how I would wear this right now. But I feel like I should be able to pull something together. That is everything that I got. Um, I'm going to go ahead and end off this Vlogtober here. I hope that y'all enjoyed it. Thank you so, so, so much for watching. And I will see y'all in my next video.